What's up, OMG Nation? On today's episode, it's a review of the first manufacturing company's hipster men's leather motorcycle jacket. So about seven months ago, right at eight months, I purchased this jacket from first manufacturing company. It cost me $270. First manufacturing company calls this a scooter style jacket. It comes with a single banding collar and a center zipper. Two zipper vented chest pockets. Two slash pockets as well. It comes with zippered sleeves and button snaps and gussets as well. This is a YKK zipper, top of the line zipper, very strong. Inside, this jacket comes with a thermal insulated zip out liner. So you can take this completely out and I'll show you that in just a minute. It also comes with two concealed carry pockets with the bullet buttons. That's pretty cool, check that out. So the back of this jacket, they call it an action back, which gives you plenty of room to move around. This jacket, I put a lot of miles on it. I've ridden with this jacket in 17 degree temperature. I've ridden with this jacket all the way up over 95 degrees. With the zip out liner, this jacket really wasn't that hot over 95 degrees. It has armor pockets and the first manufacturing company, they have CE2 rated CE armor that fits this jacket that you can put in here in the back. And this is the shoulder. <laughs> so you can put the CE rated armor right here. They have a pocket for it right here. Slides in the back. They have a pocket for the shoulder. And then right in here on the inside, I've actually got some in here. They have a pocket right in the elbow. So the action back, vented. YKK zipper on both sides. It even says it right here on the tab. YKK zipper. So my chest size is a 43. I got a medium. This thing, I'm 190 pounds. This thing fits me perfect. Not too hot in the summertime. On trips, I've worn a thermal shirt, a t-shirt over the top of that. This liner and this jacket, and I felt fine. I wasn't cold, I didn't have any heated gear on. I'll tell you, I've been extremely impressed with this jacket. One of the main reasons that I picked the hipster jacket, so two reasons basically, is it has, they call this a distressed black color. It has a hint of brown to me in it. Um, also, this, is, this jacket to me, I feel like that I can wear it inside and someone just thinks that it's a regular jacket. It's not, um, it doesn't really look like a motorcycle jacket if I was to take the armor out, um, e even in the elbow pads. Well, even with the armor in, you can't really tell that the armor's in. So you don't look like you're wearing a motorcycle jacket. If I wanted to go out on the town and throw this on and just be the, the cool guy leather jacket, then hey, that's the reason I chose this. I, I mean, on a scale from one to 10, I give it 10 OMGs, baby. <laughs> I give it a 10. Uh, I think First Manufacturing Company, they hit it out of the park when they made this jacket. Uh, I'm not sponsored by these guys. They didn't give me this jacket for free. Again, like I said, I paid $269.99 plus tax for this jacket. I'll give you a good solid look at it again.
So that's my review on First Manufacturing Company's Hipster Men's Leather Jacket. If you guys have any questions, hit me up down in the comments. Let me know. I'll try to answer them the best I can. I appreciate you guys watching. Hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you on the next episode. Thanks for watching, everyone. <laughs>